guys, Tyler Brown here, Stone Slow Church. Just got done uh, teaching the kids for the week four of the Westminster Confession series. Um, this week our old term was covenant. Uh, it's defined as an agreement with relationship. That's what should be on the kids' cards this week. Um, we talked about some examples of covenants such as marriage or God's covenants with man over time, whether it be with, through Moses, through Adam, or through Jesus, uh, eventually the new covenant. And so we started there, and then we uh, went into uh, who are your first parents? That's the question today. And the answer that they learned, which should be on the cards, is Adam and Eve who sinned against God. So Adam and Eve, our first parents, who sinned against God. Um, and so kind of had the angle we took on that, we went into the creation narrative, we talked about God creating them, and what's called the covenant of works, which is um, the cultural mandate, and it is uh, the deal God made with them, that upon the condition of perfect obedience, that they should obey the law, that they should not eat the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. But, as most of you know, the story went south, Adam and Eve sinned against God by eating of that tree, and then, as a result, uh, they, the covenant of works became one that resulted in their condemnation. So what we had is we played some deal or no deal. We had this bag, which signified the covenant of works. There was a piece of paper in it that had the covenant of works written on it, versus this one, which is called the covenant of grace. So the covenant of grace is instituted in the next chapter when Jesus, or I'm sorry, God slaughters an animal um, it, and gives them coverings, which are better than fig leaves. And so that symbolizes that start of the covenant of grace. And to this day, that everybody's either in the covenant of works or the covenant of grace. Uh, the covenant of works is um, trying to keep the moral law in order to gain God's favor, and obviously none of us are able to do that according to the New Testament, uh, versus the covenant of grace, wherein we have forgiveness, um, which culminates in the coming of Christ. And so that's kind of the angle we took today. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to hit me up online. Uh, we look forward to seeing you next week. Still, with his glory.